I knew a few light keepers when there were all kinds of lighthouses around here. My father-in-law was a lighthouse keeper on Briar Island. They started closing them up, closing them up, and people just started disappearing. Some people went to other ones, and some people just stopped. But I think this one was offered to a few people, and not very many took it. So. Well, I get up quarter to two in the morning. The nice thing about here is you step out of bed, you're at work. <laughs> Halifax Coast Guard Radio, Halifax Coast Guard Radio, this is Machai Seal Island, Machai Seal Island, Jam 19, come in. There's always something to keep you busy, but you don't have a timetable saying you have to get up this morning and do this, or you have to do that, so you pretty well pick and choose what you want to do, when you want to do it, when you can handle what it is that you're doing. One shift is 2 a.m. to 10 a.m., and the other shift is 2 in the afternoon till 10 in the evening. I feel now that instead of being the keeper of the light out here, you're more of the keeper of the island and, and looking after it as opposed to just the mechanical systems that are on it. You're only bored out here if you want to be bored. If you're going to be bored out here, you're going to be bored anywhere. You just take a walk outside and look. There's always different birds to see. There's always something different going on. You know, you look around, and if it wasn't for the houses and stuff here, you'd think it's the same as it was 10 million years ago. Pretty quiet in the wintertime. The thrill of being out here in a storm is nice. You can get some really nice pictures. I think one of the nicest things is you come out here and you just kind of escape from reality for a while. This is your little piece of reality. <laughs> you make it whatever you want it to be. 